Hi everybody, I'm Fred Smith with Open Labs. We're uh, sitting here with uh, Timbaland, superstar yeah. producer, big time man yeah. on the block. How you doing, Tim? I'm pretty cool, pretty awesome, cool. Awesome. A little sick, but I'll be all right. I hear you, I hear you. It was a good show last night. Yeah, it was yeah. an amazing show. Yeah, Dallas was, Dallas was uh, pretty live. They brought, they brought our energy out. Awesome, awesome, yeah. awesome, man. Well, thanks for uh, taking a little time out of your busy schedule to come down and talk with us and everything. So, uh, how'd you first hear about Open Labs? Uh, I first heard about Open Labs through uh, one of my friends. His name was Brian Kidd. Uh, he had saw it, introduced me to us, and go on this website and said, "Check it out." You know, because we was using laptops and stuff like that. Yeah. He was like, uh, "If you," he said, "Man, we got a computer all into one." Mm -hmm. I'm like, Ain't "No way!" <laughs> and he showed me online. I was like, "Let's order like seven of them. <laughs> Let's get them." Yeah, so I ordered like two for the start. Mm -hmm. Every since then, I kind of been playing with it and using it. So, uh, what artists have uh, have you produced using Nico? Uh, I use uh, what artists have produced using Nico. Uh, Fat Joe, I did a Fat Joe record off of the Nico. I did a uh, it's, it's a lot of little stuff. I did some uh, some justice stuff off of the Nico. Okay. Uh, See, I did a, a lot of my new artist stuff that's coming out off of the Nico. Okay. I did uh, the Fallout Boys kind of off of the Nico. Uh, it's a lot of little artists. I don't, you know, I, I use, you know, like you just use an equipment piece of equipment so much, you just don't. I just look at it like, oh, yes, I am using Nico. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, yeah. So, like, having it all right there, does that really help your creative process and get into making a track? I mean, having it all right there, having the, the Miko all right there, and yes, because it's like, it's because it's like, it's a, it's, it's your disc case, it's your turntables, mm -hmm. it's everything that you would need mm -hmm. in one piece of equipment. All right there, you know, like right at your fingertips, all right in one box. Yeah. Great, great. So I know you just said you used it on uh, Justin's new record. Yeah. And you used it on your new record, Shock Value. Yeah, coming I, use out it, I use it on my shop. April yeah. 3rd, is that yep. what's coming out? April 3rd. All right, all right. We can't wait to hear that. Yeah. And I just use it, you know what I'm saying, to tell my engineer to print this, do that. Yeah. We can edit, we can go through effects and do certain things, and it comes out like a masterpiece. Yeah. <laughs> Smoking. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like yeah, next hit. good. Man, so you plan on using uh, your new special edition Miko in your next project? Um, yeah, I'm 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 going to make it where it's officially like Tim's touch. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to use it everywhere I do because first of all, it's small. It's easy to travel with. Mm -hmm. And it kind of can eliminate a lot of my cases and disc cases and stuff. Gotcha, gotcha. You don't have to carry around all that other stuff and everything. No, I don't have to carry around nothing. Just, just do it. Yeah. You know? Get it all right there. Exactly. Awesome, awesome. Well, Tim, thanks for uh, spending time with us. Thank you. Time your busy time. Thank you know, you. To talk about the Open Labs experience and everything, and share that's that with our people. It's been a there great experience. Go. I mean, I'm, I love how y'all keep changing up. You know, y'all listen to what I'm saying, and mm -hmm. you make the changes, and it become a perfection. You know, exactly. And it's just you know, perfection for my use. Uh -huh. You know, so that's what I love about it. All right, we try. We try to make the products better because uh, we're musicians ourselves. We make music. You know, and yeah. other people make music, our clients make music, our customers make music, so we're just trying to make it a better product for everybody. There you go. <laughs> All right. Can't go man. wrong.